All right, good job, guys. Uh, High five. Thanks, Harry. Plushies. What did you do? The plushies took over. What did you do? All right, new internet. <laughs> Oh, not new internet. Not new but internet. But internet. Hopefully smoother internet. I'm asking Sam again. to check our strength again. Um, I would just like to point out, um, before I came down here, I was going up to drop off that, uh, that, that last uh, challenge thing in our shipping office, uh, and Jess is in there attempting to figure out how to pack all the, the escapist uh, stuff. All the escapist stuff. <laughs> oh, no. So uh, she has the put your thoughts on it with, uh, with Jess. Yeah. Uh, she, it is difficult time. She is going to have a very difficult time. All right. It is 1.52, so I have to tease a really sweet live auction lot, which we're going to do but first, at 2. There are silent auctions ending in 10 minutes. Yeah, we okay. better do that quickly. Graham, talk about our silent auctions. They're ending in 7 minutes. <laughs> Three, uh, sorry, five, five Riff Track DVDs signed by Mike Nelson. Uh, Shorts Toberfest, Santa and the Ice Cream Bunny, Planet of the Dinosaurs, Plan 9 from Outer Space, and Order in the Shorts. Uh, signed by Mike Nelson of Riff Track. Check that out. How much are they going for? Yeah, currently going for? Currently going for 275 Nice. Not um, enough! And, oh, more, and there's, sorry, the next silent auction is actually only ending in two hours and seven minutes, and that is three tickets, three tickets, tickets, to two the tickets. Child's Play Charity... <laughs> oh, Lot 3, sorry. Two tickets. Sorry, Internet. Two tickets to the Child's Play Charity Dinner. We'll be there. How much are those going for? Uh, th mm, about 350 About 350 350 350 About 350 Oh, 350 Sorry, you were saying. All right, so coming up in a couple minutes, if there's oh, a guy no, named... Okay. Tomorrow Boy 01 in the chat. That's my friend Matthew, who has bought something from his own dollars, gotten it signed at his own expense, and mailed it to me out of the goodness of his own heart. It is, Graham, I need you to model this oh. for me. Ba -da 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 -da. A signed copy of Hark a Vagrant, the latest beautiful hardcover book by Kate Beaton. A very, 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 very good book by a very talented lady named Kate Beaton. She's a Canadian. She's awesome. It is personalized to Desert Bus. And as you can see from the personalization where she's like, whoa. I have, I have a feeling that she was like, it, I am like neck deep in my tour and I have, have no, no idea, idea what, what I, Desert Bus is. Can you put it on a skull cam? Oh yeah, I can. It is Excuse signed. Me, oh, we didn't put BidBot out when we did that. Oh well. It is signed to Desert Bus. So it's like it's personalized to you. Thank you so much for to oh. Matthew. Skull cam is booting up. For purchasing this. Wait, there he is. And giving it to us, sending it to us at his own expense, and I'm gonna reimburse him for it as soon as he has a permanent permanent address because he's moving soon. Yeah, as you can see, she was just like, sure, why not? I love that so much. But desert bus, Harka Vagrant. I like her little bus rendering though. Yeah, it's good. So that's going to be, that's going on in 10 minutes, 15 minutes? That, no, that's going on in like 6 minutes. Oh. So if you like Kate Beaton, or you know somebody who likes Kate Beaton, maybe we could bid on this. There's no time listed on the... No, it's just... The chances are you do. Huh. We've been talking about it for a while. Uh, we did oh. announce the giveaway winners. Was it still on Skull Cam? No, you're just a little bit behind that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. More, way more behind than I thought. We did announce the winners. Graham, could you read out the winners that you drew, one that we drew? Oh, just moments ago? Just moments ago before the thing went down, because I believe we still have them up. Yep. Uh, well, we don't, but I can find them again just as easily. Oh, wow. It looks like we have chapter 7 and 8 of Butts and Dangler. Excellent. Nice. Um, I, keep th I keep thinking them about, like, rather than, like, Butts and Dangler, they fight crime. Or, like, the law offices of Butts and Dangler. Yeah. Well, I had a horrible moment earlier. I was going through all the Google Ads stuff, and I accidentally was just clicking on each email, and I accidentally clicked ah, on one of those submissions, and like, oh, God, what's <laughs> this? Uh, Keldane won the right. prize pack. And, oh, there's an email from him here saying that he lives in Victoria, and he can come pick it up. Sweet. Make sure you do, because that happened that once. Now. And that happened once, and someone did Yeah, you, you could you, say that if it is not picked up by the end of Desert Bus, we're going to re-auction it. Can you <laughs> pull the blog up? I you wanna... we never actually announced the winners for our Google Ads challenge. I mean, oh, yeah. They're announced on the blog, but we never told you guys. Okay, yes, uh, one second. Let me just, um, yeah, but the, the five download code winners are Sayrig, uh, Brad Ped, who doesn't have a donor account, that's just his email address, Riger, 
Sherloco, and BW12, who also doesn't have a donor account. Um, Keldane, if you want to come and pick it up, come and pick it up, like, now. now. Yeah. Because then we can make sure that it's... That we that, that that you do that. Yeah, because if people don't come and pick it up, that makes us very really sad. Well, we've had bad the, luck with people. Who picked people. the winner for the co-op challenge, by the way? Uh, uh, we all did. Oh, it's a, really? Click, click on it. Click no, on it's it. an animated GIF. Oh. Oh, oh this oh. makes more sense. Oh, okay, okay. that's amazing. <laughs> all we saw was the straight. <laughs> that is button. amazing. Like, really? Okay, no, that's that's really that's really good. That's cool. Because I saw that, and I'm like, that's a joke we're making all night, and we'd seen this one, which I loved. <laughs> of Roscoe and the <laughs> minus 1.2 meters. Yes. Yeah, see. <laughs> no, no, that's a winner. Okay, animated. yeah, the animated GIF, completely a winner, no question. All right. How long does it take to get from Vancouver to Victoria? <laughs> if you drive about uh, four oh. hours with the ferry and traffic and all that stuff, depending on where yeah. you're coming from in Vancouver. Depends on, yeah, where you're Assuming the, traffic, the, ferry the time of day and the four ferry. Hours, four hours. <laughs> if the ferry isn't there, it could take quite a bit longer. <laughs> the actual ferry ride itself. Who's <laughs> saying Paul was the 100 meter quap? Yeah. Sorry, googly eyes. Yes. Yeah. So it's it's up on the blog, so you can actually go and see all yeah, of the, the submissions because the there are some really good ones. But so many googly eye submissions. So, so many so googly eyes on Africa. I know. Well, the third place winner was our favorite of the Africas. So that goes to Sam. Africa. It's pretty cute. And then second place, look great. Mm. Second place is to uh, Tsukiari, uh, whose name I keep getting wrong. The guy who did the stained glass, the auction that we just had. Actually, one second place for the Jenga, Liz Tsukiya and Jenga Kari Tower. Usagi. Thank you. And first place is actually, I had no idea until after we picked it, but it's actually from Rocket Siobhan oh. from the Lore Forums. <laughs> so she's first place for the yams who are cuddled up together in one of them. That's a real. I needed a doll. That's an actual photo of googly eyes. Yeah, yeah she the, actually oh, had okay. googly eyes. Well, of course. Of course. Yes. I thought that yeah, was a really, really good. good. And so, I, I understand that somewhere in here is a picture of. I'm, they actually got the, an item. I yeah. love the dubstep so that one, someone's too. already received their auction prize? I, I know. know! The system works! Where is it? It's the uh, Atlas breakfast tray and other things. Oh, That's hey, amazing. Relly! What am I holding? I'm holding a signed copy of Hark a Vagrant. But oh, oh, signed by... Oh, Kathleen, the, this cat looks like Annika. He does. He's, yeah, he, he does. Like Sasha. Jeremy's old he cat. He does. Um, we also uh, really like the... Uh, by, uh, that one. Kate Beaton. The cat with the four cute. desert bus. <laughs> Isn't that great? <laughs> oh Which is just a great picture to start with. So good. I love that. I love that one. That's hilarious. It didn't win, but I love it. It's really good. So those were fun. Thank you, guys. All right. Okay. It's Hark of Vagrant. There's nothing to sweeten this lot with because it's already pretty awesome. Oh, more, more book titles. Should be and well. everybody send your love to Tomorrow Boy. Oh, what of the chat? Who bought this, mailed it, and donated it himself. This is not from Kate Beaton. That's from him out of the kindness of his heart. Aww. Thank you very much to Matthew. But I, I guess I guess more books should not be titled with Hark because that would take away from the awesomeness of it. But I love the Hark of Agrin. This was such a happy little... Well, that's so, the name, that's the name that. of her strip as a whole. Oh, is it really? Yeah. yeah. Nice. Good like name. Oh, yes. There was a print. It got bent in the mail, and I, I'm really sorry, Matthew, but I, I looked at it, and I was like, it's kind of bent. Canada Post mangled it a bit, and I was like, I don't, I really, oh. I feel really bad, but I didn't really want to auction a print that was already bent. Uh, oh, Keldin, email prize at desertbus.org, and we will send you back our address. We're not saying it on the chat. Uh, he did. I will send that now. Time uh, Lord, Time Lord, your prize was the uh, uh, third. I'm really the sorry, Matthew. The, buttons, the eight bit buttons and the um, Laura decal and a creepy doll decal. Somebody uh, brings up a good point that uh, Justin McElroy will be phoning in. At yeah. 3. At 2.30. So, come up. Uh, and so, so 2.30? No, a yeah. blog post should be up uh, that you can ask questions in, so do that. Yeah. You should, you should sing some songs <coughs> or do some dances or something. All right, so this is for lot 211. Can we get Bidbot going here? I'm trying to move things along on time. And Matthew, what do you want the live auction music to be? <coughs> oh, see, uh, Chico, uh, Chicolini, we were like really trying to uh, clear out uh, challenges, so we may have deleted challenges that we couldn't do. And so, just resubmit. We did. 
Although, what we did last night, that system really Word worked. Works amazingly we well. We were like, what, okay. What did you do? Well, we were like, okay. We don't have anything, we don't have any auctions scheduled. Yeah. So we're going to say this next two hours is challenge time. That's a good idea. And we, we opened it for two minutes, we closed it, and we were like, look at everyone who's here. Only submit challenges for people that are here. Mm -hmm. And we went through, it took 15, 20 minutes to actually go through them all. Mm -hmm. And we only rejected maybe five or six. Yeah. Huh. And, and then, then we just spent the next two hours doing them, and it went really, really well. It was a ton a of fun. That's a great idea. We should do that again tonight. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's, it's this afternoon whenever we have time. There's a lot going on this afternoon. It's yeah, exciting. that's the thing. Next year we're going to have to balance more with making mm -hmm. sure we have longer stretches of time between things like guests and auctions to make yes. sure that we can mm -hmm. do stuff like that. Um, but it's a learning experience. Yeah. Yeah. Matthew, do you have a specific oh, song you'd, earlier like, earlier you'd like to play? That's this year's success. I'm, I'm okay with making Plaid the official band of yeah, Desert Bus 5. <laughs> I got, I, Kathleen and I usually differ quite a bit on music tastes, but that's one that I, like, I never heard of them, and you were playing that song the other day, I'm like, I really like this. Which one? The, I don't know which song it was, but she played something by Platt. Mm -hmm. I think, I, I think it really, was something off Which is not to say anything about my taste being bad or her taste being bad. No, they're just very different. different. They're just different. But There's I found this that. place where they very much intersect. I was like, this is awesome, play, and I'd never heard of them. Play so. Uh, we played that, that one a lot. Um, play, pull up some double play figure tracks. Caravan Palace or something. Then, who says? We actually we did we played uh, Caravan Palace last night. That's how we learned of electro swing. Yeah. yeah. That was. Oh, yeah. Yeah. The yeah, the yeah. weird electro like. That was nice. Yeah. It was the music video was a flapper mm. dancing with a robot. It was awesome. God, was oh, that, that last one. night? Yeah. yeah. I totally don't know what you're talking about. It's a really fun fun. All right. Song. Anyhow, pull up. Insipid words. Pull up. Fine. <laughs> We want. Yeah, uh, Mia introduced us uh, a while ago. Pull up Assault on Precinct v Zero, and then just pull up like a, and just keep going through the songs on the album. So let's start. Let's start Bidbot up for lot two eleven. Hark of Agrid, sign Hark by Kate Beaton. Hark of Agrid. I will never get tired of saying that. Five hundred dollars from Build a Cat. Yay, Build a Cat. He's got great taste in comics, clearly. Oh, your friend is Build a Cat. Has no, none. My friend is tomorrow. Oh, oh, oh. but I just like Bill the Cat's yes. name. Because he likes that in my county. As none. Double madness. <laughs> all the way across the bus. Even. That was, that was a donation to get double madness to change that. Nice. Someone wanted us to change five times madness to quack couple madness. Yeah. We don't have to, though. 625, uh, no, something original's bid didn't go, didn't get recognized. Huh. And he's got voice, he's, he's got yeah. plus. He's repeatedly trying. Why is, why, something original wants to know why bid bots are normal. They're on it. Oh. Proto Baggins at 605. Ah. I'm very registered, he says. Yeah, because he's won something yeah. before. Huh. He won, he won the, yeah. he, he won the things like that, hey, just artwork. So do we... Uh, try bidding one more time, please. As none, 620. <laughs> All these other bids are still below where, uh... Nope, there we go, worked that time. Something original, 625. The bid you were trying to make that whole time. This is Platt. It's a bit loud. Both, actually, according to them. Six forty from Asnun. 